energizing your soul through the inspired Word of God. This is your daily devotional reading. My Life Today, a devotional by Ellen White. January 19th. The Bible stands without a peer. Thus saith the Lord, the maker thereof, the Lord that formed it to establish it. The Lord is his name, the Lord is his name. Call unto me, and I will answer thee, and show thee great and mighty things which thou knowest not, which thou knowest not. The Bible stands without a peer. Call unto me, and I will answer thee, and show thee great and mighty things which thou knowest not. No other study will so ennoble every thought, feeling, and aspiration as the study of the scriptures. No other book can satisfy the questionings of the mind and the craving of the heart. By obtaining a knowledge of God's word and giving heed thereto, men may rise from the lowest depths of ignorance and degradation to become the sons of God, the associates of sinless angels. As an educating power, the Bible is without a rival. Nothing will so impart vigor to all the faculties as an effort to grasp the stupendous truths of revelation. The mind gradually adapts itself to the subjects upon which it is allowed to dwell. If occupied with commonplace matters only, it will become dwarfed and enfeebled. In its wide range of style and subjects, the Bible has something to interest every mind and appeal to every heart. In it, the most simply stated truths are involved, principles that are as high as heaven and that encompass eternity. There is no position in life, no phase of human experience for which the Bible does not contain valuable instruction. Ruler and subject, master and servant, buyer and seller, borrower and lender, parent and child, teacher and student, all may here find lessons of priceless worth. But above all else, the word of God sets forth the plan of salvation, shows how sinful man may be reconciled to God lays down the great principles of truth and duty which should govern our lives and promises us divine aid in their observance. It reaches beyond this fleeting life, beyond the brief and troubled history of our race. It opens to our view the long vista of eternal ages, ages undarkened by sin, undimmed by sorrow. My Life Today, January 19th. I encourage you to be ye doers of the word and not hearers only. Thank you for listening and be sure to join us tomorrow for your daily devotional reading.